What's going on everyone? It's the King of Ruckus, and this is some Batman Free Pro Challenge, as I promised before. Uh, this is actually a really easy map. It's probably my... I want to say my third or fourth try. I was just trying to get a perfect run, and I came pretty close, but I made a little mistake, which you'll see later. But, uh, in this first round, all the enemies are together, so there's really no problem keeping your combo going. Rounds two and three, you really gotta run ahead and make sure you have all the enemies in the same area. Otherwise, you'll fight like two or three of them, and then you'll be standing there thinking the rounds, <laughs> thinking the rounds over. When really you're supposed to run up ahead and get them all together. So seeing this inside, seeing this in like side scroller style, really makes me wonder why they didn't go for two player, even just on these maps here. Because the camera, it's less of a problem than it would be in the usual top-down mode that they have going for fights. It's not really a complaint, just more of an observation. Because I'd, I'd love to be able to play this with a friend, like, either online or in the same room. It's just, uh, Rock City really hasn't been going for that. Maybe they were thinking about it, and this was a step in that direction. I really don't know. Dark Knight skin is ridiculous. It's, it's just so detailed. Like all the extra costumes are. to the boss now here. There's a little there's a little trick regarding him. City is gonna there he goes right there, black mask. And what you have to do is is take him out with a cape stun and beat down. If you don't, you'll hit him three times, he'll get stunned and he'll fall on the floor. When you go for the ground pound, the ground takedown or whatever it's called, the ground pound, he moves out of the way. And when he gets up from that, you can hit him once. And your combo will still keep going. But you hit him once, he'll hit the floor, and then you just get locked in this cycle where you go for the ground pound, and then when he gets up, you know, you hit him once, he'll hit the floor again. If you don't go for the ground pound fast enough, you lose your combo. But if you take him out this way with the cape stun to the beat down finisher, you can just take him out in one fell swoop. Keep the combo going, take everyone else out. like my, my third or fourth time trying this, so I already knew where to go. I was hoping I could keep it going, but it doesn't let you. So that's the end of this playthrough here. I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, just be sure to leave a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.